Instant cats. Just add water. <laughs> and they say cats don't like water. <laughs> Let's just sneak on by. Aww. Nothing to see. Home free. Oh, coochie coo. <laughs> this is gonna be a great day. Oh, I jinxed it. Hmm. This bed could use a makeover anyway. <laughs> Remove this wood. Add a panel to the side. Oh, anyone getting dizzy? A fresh coat of paint fixes up everything. All three walls. Let's see what we can do for the outside. A stencil pattern. Let's spread on some paint. Who says we need a brush? Besides, this is much faster. Peel off. On second thought, a brush can take care of the little details. Look, a cat face. As if you didn't guess who this was for. Hmm, this hole looks scratchy. And not the kind cats like. This cat door will help make an easy entrance. And with the help of these toothbrushes, the cats will get the scratches they like. Let's take a quick tour, shall we? This grass carpet will please the wild cat inside your pet. What else can we add? Hmm, an old pizza box? Cover with tape, and you can make a few steps. Steps right to the cat's own private bathroom. Meet the new and improved litter box. Now, what else do cats like? How about this? Take some rope and twist it around a base. Tie it so it's nice and tight. And your cat has a new scratching post. What else? Maybe they'll like that pigeon. Oh, even better. Take a desk drawer. Add pillows, cushions, and some toys. And it's a brand new bed. Here's something we can add to the wall. Now your cats have their own private television. Oh, it's getting hot in here. You know, the cats might want a drink. So, let's give them their own fountain. After all, it's easy to get hot when you can't take off your fur coat. Always smart to try things out before trying on the cats. Now that they have water, they might want something to nibble on, too. And we're going all natural with cat grass. And there's plenty of room for a bowl full of cat chow. But let's keep the fridge stocked with wet food, just in case. Everything's really coming together. Let's add some more toys. Well, he's off to Wonderland. What's down there anyway? Ooh, candy. Oh, this bowl should fill up the hole. It's the perfect place for some cat toys. And if the cats are feeling a bit hungry at playtime, this toy's the perfect thing. Just add food. See, they'll get a treat when they spin it around. That'll keep them active. Hey, can we borrow this pillow? Now take some tights and cut them up. We need an X shape with some material in the middle. Tie each of the two opposite ends together. It's like a bed and swing all in one. Let's test it out. You know, these buttons can help get their point across. They can tell us when they want water, food, or even playtime. It's a bit too small to be a staircase. But we can still use the base. 
attached to the wall, and we've got stairs after all. Hey, you're not using this giant bucket, are you? <gasps> Thanks! Huh? Now that we've cleaned it out, we'll cut out an opening. Huh, what else do we need? How about more toys? You can never have enough cat toys. And we can use them for a project. Hot glue them to the patch from earlier. You remember from the hole? Add them to the bottom of our can for a soft cushion. Now break out the power tools. We're drilling some holes. After making a few, run some thread through them. It's kind of like a checkerboard pattern. The cats are gonna be so happy. Where are they anyway? I uh, think you've got a little something there. Oh, that gives me an idea. Add hot glue, press it down, and it's as good as laminated. Perfect for keychains or personalized collars. This cat toy's interactive. Let's add it to our collection. Cats sure have good taste. This looks fun. Cat food? Maybe we should leave some things to the cats. Oh, it's just a toy. And we've got the perfect place for it. You know, it's a little small. We need to think bigger. Let's get a large glass container filled with water. Fill with stones and marbles. Add a plant. And the finishing touch, these cute little fish. I spy with my little eye, well, her eye, eyes, a plastic bottle. Empty it and cut it up. Take the bottom and hot glue some string in the middle. Now use the string to reattach the two pieces. Add a pom-pom to the top and fill with cat chow. Hang it up. More snacks? These are gonna be some lucky cats. Cool, a laser for our cats to catch. Let's try it out. Either it's the laser or she needs to clean her pores. Hard to catch, just what we need. What's on your head? It's like a fidget spinner. Let's add to the wall. What can't be improved with the addition of stickers? These pictures will help give it a more homey feel. Some more toys. Cats sure know how to live. Maybe we can put this tablecloth to better use. As the curtains for our brand new cat hangout. Yeah, this is where all the cool cats come to play. Great place for a nap. You gotta for a big day of sleeping. Still, look at all the fun stuff to do. Eat grass. Use stuffed animals as a floor. Or just relax. Looks like someone's ready to play too. Or maybe just stretch. You gotta love all the accommodations. And there's still so much more to explore. Who needs steps when you have a giant scratching post to climb? Unwind, watch a little TV, have a drink. Oh no, he's found the cats. I mean, what cats? Oh, it's love at first sight. 
Meow horrific stuff. Catch you next time. Oh, trash day again. Uh, Seems like we did this last week. Uh oh. The raccoons are back. Oh, wait. That's no raccoon. Oh, what a cute little puppy. And look, no collar. Good thing you already got this pet backpack on you. Aquariums. They're not just for fish anymore. Huh. There's not a lot of leg room, is there? With a backpack like that, he's ready to go into space. Right out of the case, and he's already got muddy paws. Oh, right, you found him in the trash. Well, a nice warm bath should perk things up. Or don't dogs lick themselves clean? No, wait, that's cats. How cute, a dog brush. And it even has a little place to hold your soap. Rub-a-dub-dub. This must be a dog's favorite type of bath. The kind that doesn't use any water. But it works. Mm-hmm. Good thing. Otherwise, he'd be shaking the water off. And we wouldn't get this tender moment. Wow. He must be clean to be on the furniture clean. And now he gets his own wardrobe, too. Huh, a little big, but maybe he'll grow into it. Oh, wow, look at those nails. We need a manicure, hmm. stat. Sure, I've seen green nails before, but that was just paint. Why stop at the nails? Let's take care of that fur, too. Mm-hmm. Of course, the most important part of a beauty routine, canine or otherwise, is keeping clean. Cue the foam. Still, no true day of pampering is ever complete without some form of facial mask. Ooh. Hmm, what else can we do for our day of indulgence? Oh, good idea, some brushing. With a tongue? I repeat, isn't licking yourself clean more of a cat thing, not a dog thing, or a people thing? At least it seems easy to clean. Ah, now for a massage. Oh, and look, we've got a gadget for that too. First a nice neck rub, and then just work your way down the back. Hmm, does it work on people? Well, I guess you can after all. Though you should probably ask before using it. Mm -hmm. Time for dinner. Good, because I haven't eaten in like a whole hour. Mmm, a nice <laughs> salad. And the puppy gets... Mm, yeah. Just some kibble. And even he doesn't look yeah. too appetized. Maybe hmm. it's all in the presentation. Ooh. Let's cut along the lines. It's just like coloring. And we want some bend to it, so add some tape. Now everything's got a nice shape. But still, we don't want to show off something that looks like cardboard. Gold-colored paint covers hmm. all sins. Ooh. And so do a bunch of fake jewels. Just don't advertise the fake bit. Man, and all this just to host the dog food bowl. Speaking of which, can we jazz up the food here too? Great! Good boy. Look at him eating. All gone. Yes, it's true what they say. You reap what you sow. Wow. I wonder if that dog knows the goose that laid the golden egg. Anyone think they're related? Well, into the drawer. Oh, what's this? Oh, this hmm. looks like a collar. Huh? Just what our four-legged friend needs. But it needs something extra. Rhinestones are nice and all, but we want something personalized. And a photo will help show ownership. Well, oh, looks like he's on a roll. Literally. He's gonna look so handsome with his new collar. Which means that it's the perfect time for a selfie. Give us a smile. Show us some teeth, but not in a show of dominance sort of way. Any other photo ideas? 
Let's make a fun border. Now pick a theme. Ah yes, the source of all happiness, money. Just don't use the real kind. Though by the looks of things, this new owner can probably afford to. Oh, he'll look so handsome in his portrait. Surrounded by Ooh. money. Just like Scrooge McDuck. Oh. After all this hmm. pampering, it's finally time for our puppy to relax. You better be planning a game of fetch, taking hmm. his ball like that. Oh, wow, hmm. a golden bone! Let's hope it's not real. I mean, you could chip a tooth. Hmm, seems like enough fun for today. It's time to get ready for bed. Or instead, time for another craft. Hmm, with this mold, we can make a bunch of little jewels of different sizes and colors. Put them all together, and we can make a fun mobile. Like for a baby crib. Just hang it up, and he's fast asleep. Wow, I thought he would need a bedtime story or two. Let's cut back to daytime. Time for a fun dress up. Ooh. And don't worry, just because dogs don't normally wear clothes doesn't mean they can't accessorize. Mm. Ah, adorable. Huh, he doesn't really seem to be a hat dog. Got anything else he'd like? How about hoodies? Well, the light up buttons have spoken. No, but red is certainly his color. And it looks like he agrees. Just add some chains and some sunglasses, and he'll make Snoop Dogg look like Snoop Cat. Ooh. Let's see what other outfits he'd like to try. A white tuxedo? Does he look like James Bond? Hmm, maybe another color will do. Oh, he seems to prefer the more <laughs> classic black look. And it certainly seems to suit him. Oh, he's just so cute. What big eyes he's got. Time for another day of fun with your furry <laughs> friend. <laughs> what can be better than a puppy? Simple, more than hmm. one puppy. Ooh. And this one's so big, you just want to cuddle them up. And soon, there'll be even more puppies. In the meantime, our blushing bride wants some kibble. And maybe a steak or two. That was bow wow-tastic. Yeah, I went there. Catch you next time. Little rich girl. Yeah. Oh yeah. no. What's gonna happen to all her pets? I mean, think of the hamster. All these bristles should make paw cleaning a breeze. And look, it's electric. Just press the button and add water. Just in time, too. Look at those dirty paws. It's like a before and after. Let's fix that. Much better. Wow. But let's try out the homemade version. Ew. It's a cup, but what do we do for bristles? Good idea. Don't forget to add water. And by the looks of it, you'll need to power it yourself. It looks like it works just as well. You'll save quite a bit if you put in some elbow grease. Yes, it's playtime. Bring on the toys. It's like a carrot patch with hidden treasure. Never underestimate a puppy's sense of smell. 
I sense a pattern. Oh, look under the carrots. Now let's see if we can make our own fun. If you ever wanted to play tic-tac-toe with animals, now you know how. Wait, do you have to eat the treats too? And it looks like we have a winner. And he's such a good sport. Finally, something for the hamsters. Wow, this is like the easiest maze ever. You win, and the prize is hamster snacks. Maybe we can have some fun with this tube too. Ew. Soon we'll have our own little labyrinth. And we can add extensions too. Just keep on eating chips. Speaking of snacks, either way, he's happy with the end result. Next up is a little something special for the cat. Wow! This combines the fun of an avocado with the things cats go nuts for, catnip. This kitty's gonna sleep well tonight. Now, what can we do with this toilet paper roll? First, cut it up into four pieces. Fold them together into a sphere and add a treat inside. And once again, the game begins. Oh, it's not free. It's priceless. Which one will she choose? I would have picked the one for the hamster. Just think of all the leg room. Being carried around, it's the only way to travel. Now it's time to try this giant mm. tote bag. Yes, never underestimate the power of legroom. Just don't make the holes too big or she'll Aww. escape. Wow. And everyone can give your pupper a nice foot rub. Of course, pets need to stay hydrated when you carry them around. And with a few little twists and turns, it becomes a fountain. Maybe we can do the same by cutting it up. Like all our best crafts, it's time to add some fire. Stick in a bottle of water. Loosen the cap and let gravity do its job. Either way, the dogs like it. Scratching posts. Because, like the best of us, cats just know the importance of getting your nails done. Well, it's a good shape, but will it be good for scratching? This yarn should help. After all, it is yarn. And cats kind of have a thing for yarn.
Let's just hot glue everything into place. And add a mustache. You know, just to keep things fancy. Good. Those nails are getting quite a workout. With googly eyes and a hat, it's a pretty good deal. But grooming isn't entirely your pet's responsibility. Hmm. These bristles will help clean up your cat's coat. Just in time, too. Ew. With all that hair, we can make a new cat. Yuck. Told ya. Well, we've got the glove, but what about those bristles? Ah, yes, hot glue. Just remember to let it dry. Well, the cat liked it, but it didn't really do anything. The toy cat can keep this. Now your cat can spend hours trying to catch fish. So after teasing him like this, you owe him a nice tuna dinner. Let's see if we can make our own version of this. Besides just letting your cat near a fish tank. Of course, adding catnip sure helps. And now you've got a kitty original to hang on the wall. What a deal! Well, when it comes to your cat's litter box, it's usually for the best to splurge. Cats need their privacy after all. I wonder if they synchronized this in advance. Probably should talk to your vet about this. Ew. Yeah, let's not waste a perfectly good sock. Here's a better idea. Let's make our own private litter box. Cool. Just need to make a door in this shelf. And add litter to the bottom. Now a cat can walk in whenever they need to. Though seriously, I'd really ask your vet about your cat and produce. As always, our animal actors were real professionals. Though the human one really could have learned a thing or two from them. Animal amazing stuff, right? Catch you next time. Happy Chicken Day, everybody! Oh. Or whatever this is. Aw, now Chicky can finally live up to his ancestors and look just adorable while doing it. <laughs> what a cute little nugget. In fact, it looks like all the animals are having a costume party today. Oh. A dog dryer. Let's hope today's toys are all about our furry friends. But first, Let's make sure it actually works. Thank goodness we already have a wet puppy. What a good girl, staying calm while putting something on her. Let's hope she stays nice when the dryer turns on. Well, if you ever wanted a puppy puppy, here you go. Wow, it works. And while you're here, why don't you subscribe? Anything that makes balloon dogs is worth its weight in gold. A dog umbrella? Wait, how is she going to be able to hold that handle? Something tells me that chain is going to answer that. Right, the hook keeps the umbrella close by while you hold it. Good thing, too. It looks like a real storm out there. 
And there's even room for two. But the important thing is that the dog's okay. I guess this is a tool that you and your furry friend can share. Yeah, relax those smile muscles. Seriously, she smiles way too much. But let's try it out on your cat. Wow, he seems to like it. You've got yourself a real Cheshire cat here, don't you? I wonder if it works on pets other than cats. Let's see. This thing seems to be a real crowd pleaser, doesn't it? From this angle, this thing almost looks like a face. With this pouch, now you can always keep your best buddy close by. After all, why should kangaroos have all the fun? They've had it good for too long. Make sure to zip everything up. How on earth did she get that jacket on underneath? Aww. Now you can take your dog on bike rides through the park. Keep him close while doing your laundry and other chores. And even introduce them to various babies. I mean, you probably can do that without a pouch, but where's the fun in that? That lady's just jealous that you have a cuter baby. this cat toy more interactive than regular cat toys? Well, I guess we're gonna find out, aren't we? Oh, wow! Huh, it moves on its own! All the fun of playing with your cat, without actually playing with your cat. Or the fun. Yeah, in other words, some cats just have good taste. I wonder if we're gonna see anything for that baby chick. A duck muzzle? For your dog? I guess that's close enough. Okay, I see. This way, your pupper doesn't sneak snacks without you knowing. Especially any suspicious breadcrumbs. Yeah, that's right, I read Hansel and Gretel. And your puppy's already got a Halloween costume, too. Of course, dog care is a little more than just fun and games. Being a responsible pet owner can be real dirty work. In other words, honey, that's not a purse. Oh, well, get your bag ready. It's time for a walk. Oh, man. I don't want to know what you've been feeding this dog. Good idea. Use the tool. You don't know where this toy's been. And you can throw it away without getting your hands dirty. Hey, don't tell me what I can and can't use for a purse. Well, whatever this is, I'm having flashbacks to my pet hedgehog. Which is weird, considering I've never had a pet hedgehog. Aside from Sonic, that is. Either way, it's a paw cleaner, and it looks like you need to put it together. Complete with some water and a lid. Make it tight. And it looks like we already have some dirty paws to try it on. She's caught red-handed. Or maybe uh, brownish-gray-handed. Three, two, one. Success! Her paw is nice and clean. But don't forget, she's got four paws. Make sure to really get in there. And we've also got a nifty tool for cleaning those paw prints on the floor. A mop. This thing looks like a gadget from an old-timey sci-fi movie. Please tell me you're not feeding candies to your dog. Okay, good idea. Try it for yourself before testing it on your dog. I mean... I wouldn't want something happening to the dog. Good thing your dog's such a good girl. It's always time for a treat. Wow, that's a good catch. Can she do it a second time? Yes! Third time's a charm. Make that fourth. Good girl. No one cares about the fifth. That'd just be excessive. Yeah, a dog deserves a nice treat after a good workout. What's this? Oh, it's a brush for doggy bath time. Only now, we just need a magic tool to get your dog in the tub. Oh, that's clever. You even get to sneak in the soap. And every second counts once your puppy hits the water. Wow! Either you have the most well-behaved dog on Earth, or your pet fish is in serious need of a haircut. But seriously, how do you do it? Extra walks? Double kibble? 
Don't forget the towel. We don't want her to shake herself dry. Although I'm surprised such a good girl doesn't towel herself off. If only everybody else was so easy to train. By the way, who gets to tell them that's the dogs? Hmm. What's next? A tennis ball? Oh, come on, that's an old classic. Now that's more like it. Adding a techno twist. Oh, uh, not that kind of techno. Either way, she seems to be having a good time. If only they made something that puts the balls in for you. Cool. With this next tool, we get to play doggy dentist. By the way, have you subscribed already? Come on, even your dog wants you to do that. Hey, bad girl, that's the dogs. I really need to keep an eye on her. That's better. And by the looks of things, or rather, the smell. We picked the right time to try it out. If only she'd open her mouth. Don't forget to hold her still. I should have spoke sooner. There's a reason they invented dental chews. Those toys were doggone awesome. Catch you next time.